Hello there guys, Crystal here. Welcome back to Rose Wolf. Today is Monday, May 29th, 2017. I am so tired. I just got back from work. I am back later than usual because my schedule has changed because I'm no longer in training. Which means these are gonna get even more difficult to film, but that's alright. I really do enjoy them. I know you guys enjoy them, so it's a win-win. Ah, to Lucky Crystal. I Whoa, whoa, that's not brought. I bought this to use when I'm relaxing at home, but then I remembered how busy I am. But you always have loads of free time, so you should take it. It's practically brand new. From Busy Bee Pashmina. Alright, you know what? <laughs> Pashmina, maybe in-game my character doesn't have much to do, but IRL. <laughs> Alright, let me toss this. Let's see what this is. A box corner sofa. I may use that, actually. You know what? Actually, I don't have room for it right now. Uh, I could put that downstairs in the basement, though. Um, let's go take a quick look, because it is kind of a mess right now down here. It's just kind of full of just stuff. Um, let's move some stuff over here. So these things, or this thing I want to move, this thing I need to move. You can stuff back here. That is not where the table goes. There we go. Okay. Um, is it one square wide or is it two? It's one square, yeah. If I recolored it, I could use it down here. Uh, I wonder what colors it can come in. I don't even remember. You know what? Let's go check it out. We'll grab more of those um, if we decide that we'd like it. Okay, so, oh, hello there, buddy. Where, where, Bob. Bob, stop hiding, bud. There you are. Hey, Crystal, it's already dark. Where did you, where did the day go? I cannot read today. I'm so sorry ahead of time. So, anyway, what's up? When it comes to food, I'm more of a quantity over quality kind of guy. But I'd do anything to try even one perfect fruit. Will you help me make this dream come true, Crystal? Doesn't matter what kind of perfect fruit you bring me, I just appreciate any kind. Sure. That's pretty easy to do. Ooh, and you know what? Looking at the time. Let's grab some perfect fruit, and then let's go and give some to uh, Shrunk as well, because I think he's still not open for Club LOL. I think that opens at 8, I believe, so we can uh, do two things here. He's still hot. Oh no, there he is. <laughs> hey there. Because bumping into each other again. Dude, you just asked me to bring you something. <laughs> Down the hatch. Mm. Oh man, that was so good. It's almost a shame to eat it. You brought just what I wanted. A fantastic piece of fruit deserves a fantastic gift. Here, take my hedge standy. Dude, just love me enough and give me your picture, please. <laughs> Alright, so there's Bob Happy. Before I forget, let's go, uh, let's go talk to Shrunk. But also, if you guys watched the live stream, whether you watched it live or not, this is fully built. This looks awkward. I don't know if I'd like that, to be honest, but there is no changing it now. Um, I can always put bushes here, like I was saying. But anyway, the uh, the police station is built. We'll go check out the inside of it later. We want to go say hi to... I think we got Copper, right? Not Booker? Uh, I confuse them sometimes. <laughs> okay. Yeah, he isn't open yet, which is great, which means we can get another uh, emote, because I've been, like, slacking on getting them, unfortunately. I brought a snack. You can just have both of these. I don't really need either of them.
flourish joke, okay. Well, you see, I used to be a great reaction comedian a while back. So, of course I had a powerful gag that to use when I really hit a home run. I'm gonna give you an extra special treat and let you see it today. Watch carefully. Are you ready? Here I go. Oh yes, I like that one. <laughs> well, pretty easy, right? Wonder why it never caught on. I use that one quite frequently, so that makes me happy. No, wait, Shark, you have to appreciate it. No, look at me when I flourish. Man, let's go see if Bob cares. <laughs> Maybe Bob will appreciate the flourish. Okay. Um, did I pay off a house loan or do I still- I think I still have one that I haven't paid off yet. Let's go check out how much that is. I think I- I don't even remember how much I donated towards it. Or donated. <laughs> Not donated. How much I put towards it so far. Okay, um... Did I pay it off completely? Maybe we should talk to Nook? Maybe we can get our house upgraded again. When did I pay this off? Was this last time? I don't even remember what I did last time. Well, I mean, I remember what I did last time, but I don't remember paying it off, so... Did I just not talk to you yet? Oh, I didn't talk to him. Why didn't I talk to him? Uh, more space, please. Basement? Sure. And here I thought I had something to pay off. I just didn't talk to him yet. <laughs> My bad. I'm trying to remember why I didn't- I think it was because I thought that I had already fully expanded the basement. And I wasn't ready to work on the next rooms yet, but I didn't fully expand the basement. <laughs> Whoopsie. Okay. Um, what do I have in my inventory right now? Right. Okay, so. Okay, so. Let's go talk to... Hopper, I'm gonna say I'm gonna I'm gonna commit to that, and uh, and then we can also do our dailies and go around town and such. Oh, it is Copper. Oh, Mayor Crystal, Officer Copper here reporting for duty. I pledge to serve and protect the citizens of Rosewood, ma'am. Awesome. All right, so this is the uh, the police station. Essentially, it's a lost and found, but you can also talk to um, whichever one, uh, Copper or Booker, that you have, and they can tell you about, um, I guess, events coming up in terms of like the random villagers visiting, I believe. I know they can in the older games. I don't really talk to them much in this one. Lefty lucky cat. This is also... Items that you can take at any time, they're completely free. But I don't really think that I want any of these. I could give that to Bob. Maybe it is Bob's. <laughs> Maybe he lost a bookcase because that is totally a thing these villagers do every day. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'm really gonna have to fill in that area with a path- or not with a path, with bushes! It really bothers me. Okay, let's see if we can find uh, a fossil or, you know, four, maybe? Four would be nice. Should probably dig this up. Just so it isn't, uh... ruining my town or anything. Not that I think stumps can, from what I remember. So Mac is not in his house. Melba is also not in her house. Melba's right there. <laughs> oh, no, come back. Why are you running? 
Uh, let's talk. Mm, what I like this calls for making rainbow sherbet later. Aw oh, man, rainbow sherbet is like one of my favorite ice cream flavors. Love it. Love it, love it. There's a moth. I'm pretty sure we've already caught one. Like, I'm 90% sure. I think I had this, this internal argument with myself when we got the bus shelter built. Have to- wait, what? I didn't catch one yet, I don't think. Ma'am? I hear I thought I had. Not that I need to sneak on this, but... What? What? Excuse you. Excuse you. Moth. Moth. There we go. <laughs> wow, I've been running around just ignoring them because I thought I already had one. Awkward. That's my bad. Okay, anyway, back to wandering around town. I think I saw Red's tent up here, but... What time is it? Yeah, we're not gonna have time to, like, go in there and decide which one is real or not. So I'm just gonna leave it for, uh... I guess this week. I'm pretty sure he only comes once a week. But that's okay. We're not in a huge rush anyway. Ooh, there's somebody in the campsite. Last time there was somebody in the campsite, it was Stitches, so I'm kind of scared to check. Ooh! Um, are you Freya? Are you, like, Sprinkle? I don't remember your name. I get you wrong in Dream Towns all the time. I'm not gonna talk to you because I don't want you to get the wrong idea. <laughs> I don't want you to think that you're supposed to be coming here to live here. Not that she could, because I'm pretty sure we're at the ten villagers, right? Two, three, four, six. Yes, we're at ten. <laughs> Hello? Anything here? Uh, nope. Oh, hello there as well. Game is being, uh, really nice to us about fossils today. Watch well, as I can't find the last one because I've said that now. I need to think of something to do in this little area, in terms of flowers, because I don't think I want a public work project anywhere around here. Other than like, you know, you know, maybe lamps, street lamps going up and down here. But uh, I don't really know what flowers to put, so you guys, for sure, you guys have had really good suggestions so far. So I'm more than willing to listen and take your suggestions for just general, like, cute little, like, flower ideas, because obviously, um, you can kind of tell, like, I want different kinds of flowers just everywhere and different colors everywhere. So if you guys have a cool suggestion, by all means, let me know. Alright, so Gaston and Robin are both in their houses. Hello, Robin. How sweet of you to visit. Was there something you wanted? Can I ask you to help me with a little surprise crystal? I bought Gaston a gift and now I need it delivered. Would you mind helping? I'm on it. You know, he's right next door, right? And he's actually in his house and everything, right? You two ladies would go out the door, walk like three steps, and then tap on his door? <laughs> you guys are literally neighbors. Oh well. I'm not complaining. Okay, maybe that was a bit more than three steps, but like it's still like a really short distance. <laughs> hey, buddy. <laughs> yep, you take this. <laughs>
paw print wall, anything would be an improvement compared to what you have in here, buddy. <laughs> Thanks for taking the time to make that. I'm sure that got delivered. You can take this as a token of my thanks. My thank you. Thanks. Thank you? That doesn't sound all that comfortable, so I don't think I'm gonna sit on it. Pajmina is not in her house. Um, I'm missing two here still. That's all I'm missing, and then we're uh, we're good to go. I think I'm gonna snaggle a few of here these though, and uh, start breeding them elsewhere, just so that they have more room to spawn more offspring, and so that I can start putting them elsewhere. <laughs> hey, I've been hoping to see you. Gosh, I forgot. Gosh darn it, O'Hare, we need to change that stat. <laughs> hey, so what are you gonna do with that shovel there? Dig up a pitfall- not really, but... You're so audacious. Audacious? Not sure how to say that word still. You're giving me the heads up about your pitfall-related scheming. You're a fiendish little girl, aren't you? I need an adult. I need all the adults. <laughs> oh my goodness. Uh, okay. Should probably pick these up and put them somewhere, but I don't really know where just yet, so I'm gonna leave them. Uh, nothing here. I need to start filling in this. I need to work on the, the blue, um, violets, I believe? Those are lilies. I know these are lilies, but I'm pretty sure it's blue violets that I was saying I wanted. Hello there. Say, Rope of Sea, greetings are really important. Oh gosh. What is your greeting right now? Sure. Boy. <laughs> uh, I like that greeting. I'm just gonna get rid of one of those H's and then that's, that's good enough. That's a funny greeting. <laughs> did I think of that or did somebody during stream think of that? Probably somebody during stream. <laughs> Fossils here. We're still missing just one, right? Oh my goodness, my inventory's full though. Okay, let's use this space up here since this has been horribly, um. What's the word I'm thinking of here? I guess worn down from having the plot resetting villager's house go here. Okay, let's water them. And there we go. Those should be good. Hopefully they breed some more for us. Need to also work on these. Don't have enough of like other types of hybrids. I've really been focusing on the cosmos so far. Also, people are saying pink tulips. Pink and red for around um, Peggy's house and I think that's a great idea. I'm definitely going to use that. So thank you guys very much once again for your suggestions. Man, I am missing a fossil. I've probably walked by it already. Gosh darn it. <laughs> ah, that's frustrating. Oh well. Hello Wolfgang. You know how there's a fish called the olive flounder, right? Okay, at least you're not asking for a dad. <laughs> sure, I'm on it. Um, yeah, I only did get three. That's okay, though. So let's go get these assessed. We'll donate that moth while we're at it. And then, are the stores still open? They aren't, that's all right. I guess we'll go um, see if we can pitch up that olive flounder for Wolfgang. And then after that, I think, 
I'm struggling to remember, but I think we had a public works project suggested to us last time that I actually wanted to use, but I don't remember what it was. Is it the wind turbine? Uh, okay, excessive fossil first. You can take this off my hands, please. <laughs> okay. So, uh, funny story actually. Today on the bus to work, because living in Toronto, you. Housing is expensive enough, there's no point in having a car with how expensive it would be on top of that. So, um, I don't drive. But uh, on the bus today, there was actually a woman uh, holding her 3DS, and I'm like, oh, cool, alright, you know, whatever. Um, just a standard normal 3DS. And I was standing on the bus, and it wasn't until I got, like, we had to move down the bus to make room, so I was standing kind of on an angle to her that I actually saw what she was playing. She was playing Animal Crossing. I was very pleasantly surprised to say the least. You don't really- I don't know. I don't see very many people playing Animal Crossing these days. Online, obviously. There's a lot of people. The community is still rather large, as you guys know, being a huge part of it. But uh, IRL, one, I don't really know many people who play it. And two, it's just, I don't know, it's cool, like, what are the chances, you know? They could have been playing, you know, maybe a more recent uh, 3DS game, but no. Playing Animal Crossing. <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna sell a few things, not all of them, because some of these, like that, uh, I want. Deal. Okay, so you, I want to... There's a kitty bookshelf as well. Um, I want to have this refurbished, please. Yes, please, please select the black. Please let black be a color. Awesome, great stuff. <laughs> great stuff, so now all I need to do is collect the rest of the uh, box sofa uh, pieces. There's like um, just a normal uh, straight piece and there's the curved pieces, right? Um, if I just collect those, I can make like a cool, um, little seating area, I guess, in my recording room. I think that'll look quite nice once it's actually done. Uh, okay. Um, what am I doing now? Right. All of Flounder, not a dab <laughs> for Wolfgang. Still need to get rid of those roses. Watch as we fish up nothing but dabs. <laughs> Just saying, calling it right now. Oh, hello there. I can't remember what size these are, so this may take a bit. Mackerel. Um, is this one? 
No, you know, I think that size may be a bit too small. Um, maybe. I'm not really sure. <laughs> it's been so long since I've actually done any fishing. I really, really need to work on the encyclopedia for this, uh, for this town. I've been really, really bad about it. Maybe next stream. We'll see. I hope you guys, by the way, enjoyed the uh, island tours with me during the stream on Saturday. If you guys didn't see it, I have uploaded the entire stream to YouTube for you guys to see. Um, it was a lot of fun. It was a lot of fun. It's a little bit annoying to organize. That's why I don't do it every single stream. It's just, it's a little bit hectic. And people get a little bit, like, you know, butthurt when they don't get in or when they don't win. And that's fine, but don't bring the chat down with it, you know? Um, but, uh, but yeah. But anyway, no, next stream I'm probably gonna end up doing some, uh, work on the encyclopedia just because I haven't done that in a while. <laughs> and, uh, I'm kind of lagging behind. And I am not catching any of the fish I need. Gosh darn it, Wolfgang. Everything but the fish I need. <laughs> Oopsie, that's not the right way. Oh gosh, darn it, never mind. That fish was attracted to that. Who will? No, not quite. <laughs> Oh, hey, but I needed that anyway. Awesome. Oh, that one over there might be the right size. Yeah, that one is ringing a bell, so I'm gonna... I'm gonna see about that one. No. <laughs> but I did see this type of fish at the uh, aquarium last week. And it isn't actually called a zebra turkey fish. <laughs> it's called something else. I can't remember what it's called. Uh, my pocket space, though. Gosh darn it, Wolfgang. Do you really my plans? because you need a non-dab fish, which I should probably be thankful for. Gosh, is dabbing even a thing anymore? Has it just been replaced by this fidget spinners business? So silly. <laughs> just so silly. So, man, hello there. Are you one? Ye oh, awesome. Good stuff. Okay, I wasn't sure. All right, perfect. I think that was the last space in our pockets. Yeah, what luck. Alright, so let's run and take this back to Wolfgang. Hopefully he hasn't wandered too far, because it's kind of frustrating when the villager isn't where you left them. Oh, hello, hare. Oh, there you are, buddy. Oh, hi. Hey, Crystal. I've got a special favor to ask you. Here goes. I want your kitty- Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. I don't mean for free or anything. I mean... 
It was for Bob, but Bob traded his in to retail, meaning he didn't want his, therefore he probably doesn't want mine. Sure, why not? It's gonna look weird in your house, but... <laughs> All right, let's do this then. Whoa, thanks. You're the best. Well, that's a son of my thanks. Please take my swell shirt. Why, thank you. I knew I could count on you. Stay awesome. Alrighty then. I don't have pocket space, so I'm gonna have to carry this in my house, but that's okay. Anyways, you guys, I hope you enjoyed today's episode, but I am gonna have to end it here. Uh, next time I film, it should probably be Thursday, I believe, around the same time, unfortunately, because of work. I do prefer filming in the daytime, as you guys may or may not have noticed, but, uh, can't really control that while I'm working full time. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. Please, for sure, let me know if you have any ideas in terms of uh, flower arranging like I was talking earlier, but uh, but yeah, I'll see you guys later.